New York Knight Company, Britain, let's go! Wait, how do I play this game? If only someone made Zuma guides that could hold my 8 second attention span. Okay, first up, UI. Top right, we have our pause button, 2 times speed, which is pretty much permanently going to be turned on. Top left, we have the cog wheel, which just lets us quit the mission early. Then, in the top left, we have the enemy counter and our life total. This go up when enemy die, this go down when enemy leak. And that's the term we use to refer to an enemy going through the blue box, by the way. What's blue box, you ask? This is our defense objective. Enemies will spawn from the red box and make their way to their favorite blue box on the map, and we need to stop them doing that. If there are multiple blue and red boxes, like this mess, then these little red traces on the ground tell us which path the enemies will follow. They will not deviate from this path unless we make them. So how do we stop an enemy moving to the red box? Well, that's pretty simple. We use our monkeys. Wait, wrong game. We use our waifus. Or if you're feeling particularly spicy, we can use daddy's dog. But wait, how do we deploy our monkeys? I mean, our... Okay, we've done this joke already. Well, we need deployment points. If this number here is equal to or greater than this number here, then we are ready to commit war crimes. Now, with the UI mostly out of the way, let's deploy a unit. This is the no-no zone. We want to face our operator's no-no zone in a way which lets them hit the most enemies for the longest time, usually. Okay, so we know what we're trying to do and we know how to do it. Now we wait and enjoy the fruits of our labor. Okay, well, to be fair, the game does start off pretty easy, but it will eventually melt your brain with this. There's a reason our stamina system is called Sanity. <laughs> Alright, let's slow down a second. I just gave you a crash course on information that the game will tell you over its pretty slow tutorial. Some other things the tutorial will cover include missions, upgrading units, support units, the base, gacha, recruitment, daily login, and the store. There's probably something I missed here, but don't worry. We'll cover pretty much everything you need to know over the next several videos in this series. Speaking of which, here is a list of what we'll be covering. Advice for difficult stages up to chapter 3, character leveling recommendations, new player gacha guide, annihilation new player event guide, complete guide to the store, new player base guide, uh, maybe I'll leave that one to someone else. And many more. So if you're a new Arknights player or are trying to get someone into this amazing game, please feel free to drop a like on the video and make that subscribe button blush so we can get the word out there. Oh, did I mention this game has sick music? <laughs> 